If you spend any time on social media, you know that AI marketing absolutely sucks at the moment. I'm gonna tell you why it sucks, I'm gonna tell you why it's very improved to make it not suck. If you're not familiar with terrible AI marketing, let me show you. Can revolutionize the real estate industry? We'll journey through the world of AI support. We'll demystify why they're new. Get ready to discover how you can leverage technology to streamline your business operations, and enhance customer experience. Stay with us as we unravel the mystery of AI support bots and real estate. Yes, it's enough to make your stomach turn, but that's just how lazy people are in the AI marketing space. They're so lazy, they don't even care to take out the most obvious keywords that say that this is obviously AI generated. But what's wrong with AI generated content? Well, it's boring because AI never has an opinion and really struggles to get to the point when speaking to it. That's why these AI generated LinkedIn posts are so boring to read and no one engages with it. However, the AI marketers say no, if you continue to post bad content for years on end, it'll work. However, as we see in this example here, it does not work. This courageous man has been shitposting for six months straight, yet struggles to crack five likes. Now to say it doesn't work is wrong. Bad AI marketing does sort of work on dumb people. People that don't know that they're just reading opinionless, baseless AI generated content. However, if you're a business and you're trying to impress prospects and trying to get people to adapt AI into a business, then bad AI content is gonna be spotted and they're gonna say, okay, so this guy obviously doesn't know anything about marketing because this is boring to read. So it sort of works, but on the wrong people. So why does it suck? Simply put, the AI marketers are lazy. They just take whatever ChatGPT comes up with and consider that good copy and post it. And with the widespread garbage of ChatGPT garbage speak, it becomes very easy to recognize and then people don't really care about it anymore. Why? Because it screams that you're lazy. All that you did is went into ChatGPT, ask it about a topic and copy pasted exactly what it said as a post, which is why people don't find it interesting. So how do we improve it? Well, you know how we looked at birds in the sky when we thought of the idea to build planes? Well, the same way we should look at humans, see how we think and adapt that into AI. So let's say that you make a post on YouTube, Instagram, LinkedIn, doesn't matter. You post it and you see it performs terribly. What do you do? You adapt it. You try different style, you try different content, you try different keywords. And after posting enough, failing enough times, you get something that works. It's this feedback that allows us to improve and make better posts that perform better. The AI doesn't know if its posts are performing terribly. Even if it did know, it doesn't know how to improve it. If you ask ChatGPT to just improve the copy that it just wrote, it just makes it sound worse actually, with more content and keywords that just make it feel too overwhelming. Marketing and sales is a skill that is learned. However good AI may be, it still takes time for it to really understand the skill and better replicate it. Good AI marketing only exists if we give it a feedback system that is useful to it. You tell your bot, okay, that post that you just wrote, it got about 10 likes, didn't perform the way I wanted it to. Here are some posts that do perform, try to copy what they're doing, however, add some different styles and techniques to make it our own. You do that with every single post, eventually you'll strike gold. Assuming that whatever ChatGPT puts out first time works and is good is extremely naive, as I proved previously with our LinkedIn candidate. Now that AI marketing feedback loop sounds great, however, it's not a small task. So the bot is just creating this poor performing content and nobody's telling it how to improve. But the people running these agencies aren't ex-salesmen or ex-marketing managers. They're just people that use no-code software to build bots. So it's not like they know either how to make the bot's marketing speak better. So AI marketing sucks currently in 2024 because people are lazy and they don't know enough to be making these claims that they're making like five or 10 X your leads. That's not gonna happen, especially not with time. The more AI gets abused in marketing like it is being currently, the more people are gonna get educated, catch on and no longer fall for the same bogus chat GPT speak. The bar is going to continue to get higher and higher and higher. So I suggest you actually make a bot that can receive feedback from what it creates so that you future proof your bots against the impending AI marketing crash. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.